the, what we strive to do as a group together over the years is be freer and freer with the way we feel rhythm and ebb and flow is essential for creating the, sh the shape of the phrase and r really uh, sending the impulse of great rhythm to the audience. So to demonstrate this, we're going to play the opening of the A minor quartet of Mendelssohn. And at first we'll, we'll just play the first four bars kind of metronomically and see if you can hear the difference when we use a process to help ourselves feel the ebb and flow. Mm -hmm. phrase slightly differently, different tempo, a different sense of rubato, this and that. Well, it could take an hour to describe to each other what we want. So a quick solution is for each of us to try leading the group but playing small subdivisions of these notes uh, to show how this ebb and flow is on a micro level. I'll show you what we mean. And then another person may try this same process. Mm -hmm. specific sense of what each person wants using this technique. We have an exercise that's a, a really fun way of perceiving the rhythm and playing the rhythm together and communicating uh, each of our parts as well as uh, feeling the music together. And this, this game is counting the rhythm out loud, but in such a way that we're counting the so-called uh, metric feel of each measure. Each part has a certain rhythmic feel. And sometimes when we're obsessed with playing the notes and making a sound, we forget the rhythmic impulse. So we have this counting exercise that takes the instrument out of the question, and we actually speak the articulation, the mood, the dynamics, the accentuation, all all individually, and then uh, we can add it together. So in this exercise, we'll start with Helena just counting her part, and you'll see how it works. Four and one, two, three, four and one, two, three, four and one, two, three, four, one and two and three, four and one, two, three, four and one, two, three, four and one, two, three, four, one, two, three. Well, that's also the character of the piece, realize. How does yours go, Monique? Four and one, two and three, four and one, two and three, four and one, two, three, four, one and two and three, and four and one, two and three, four, one, two and three, four and one and two and three, four, one. And Jill? I start later. Two and three, four and one, two, three, four and one, two, three, four, one. Two and three, four and one, two, three, four and one, two, three, four, one. And my part starts even later. Four and one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two. Four and one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three. Now, putting it all together. Four and one, two and three. Four and one, two, 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 three. Should we play it? Yes. 